Hello everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Wasteland reviewer, and I'm here to review the new comedy, Corner Office, from director Joaquin Back and writers Ted Cupper, who wrote this screenplay based off of Jonas Carlson's The Room. And this is starring John Hamm as Orson, this bureaucrat who has very, very particular ways about doing everything and quite the comb over a mustache and glass combo to make him look like a complete creep bureaucrat that just sits at his desk all day. Now, this film is about Orson coming into this new role and finding a secret room at his job. And that's about it. That's the most glaring and unfortunate thing about this is that it does have some ideas about bureaucracy and workplace and is trying to utilize this mysterious corner office room as a way of trying to convey some big ideas. But narratively, this is thin as a piece of paper. There's nothing. You have subplots in terms of like one where Orson's trying to like woo the a woman who works at the front desk in the lobby. Um, you have his dynamic with Danny Pudi, who is Rakesh, his uh, desk mate. But there's not much at all to this story, and then this just feels like a drag for an hour and 40 minutes of, what am I watching here? Now, John Hamm is very talented and does his best with Orson. This film leans on wall-to-wall -wall narration. So basically, you're just hearing John Hamm almost the whole entire film. And it ex feels excessive, and it doesn't feel like it pops, or it doesn't feel like, say, Scorsese narration. It doesn't feel like old, hard-boiled noir narration. It just feels like the dronings on of a bureaucrat talking about his day in detail, and maybe throwing in a little paranoia along the way. It... Everything about this feels like it's lagging, that it's dragging, it's never hitting anything of substance or anything of impact. Like, I don't feel like this film really has any energy until it's final, like, five minutes. And that's not a good thing. It just is, it feels like it's on neutral for this whole entire time. And John Hamm's doing his best, but John Hamm can only do so much. This film feels like such a unfortunate misfire of what could have been a potentially interesting and weird and quirky kind of office satire. You know, they've made them before. But this just feels like a long, drawn-out, droning film that squanders a potentially interesting concept and a strong actor in its lead. So in the end, I don't think this is really worth a watch. But those are my thoughts on Corner Office. Let me know what you think. Let's talk some movies. But thank you as always for tuning in and supporting your Wasteland Reviewer.